I wouldn't want to stick too rigidly to like exactly what the lyrics say and what appears in the video because right. it's it's not meant to be exactly what it is on the surface. You know? Okay, so you'd so. be thinking more like leave make it mysterious in one sense, right. same as the Radiohead where you never find out exactly. It's just so leaves it open. Can we think of something? I'm Brian from the Fireflies and we came up with an idea for where we use the Lewis as our main scene or, or st we use the Lewis as our stage, yeah we'll say that. Really where really ideas like we've come up with is so either something, can, something different can happen at every stop. Like at a random stop something really crazy is happening and then the next stop something <laughs> even crazier is happening and then uh, we also came up with another idea where one member of the band comes into the Lewis at every stop. That's it. Uh, I'm Aidan from, I'm the drummer from Sunbirds and Set. Our pitch is basically, it's a 70s disco and the band will be on stage all in 70s attire. Uh, basically, I'll be down again, well, we'll also be down on the uh, dance floor. Uh, I'll be having a dance off with an, another Hispanic member. Uh, basically, I'll win the dance off and then we'll have a bar fight with the Hispanic gang because they're not too happy about me winning the dance off. Uh, as, as we're playing, uh, we get more battered and bruised on stage as well uh, while we're in the bar fight. Uh, other ideas we're going to have in, a few random gorillas thrown in just to kind of spice up the video and then we'll probably end with a bit of a over the shoulder jackets walking down and then maybe a jump and a click. band it'll make uh, it'll make the band look a lot more professional and I think will will appeal a lot more to record labels that will be willing to sign us because we already have a music video I think. And what about mm -hmm. the film because how would that put down? They get to work with really good people <laughs> and <laughs> party after the film is made. <laughs> okay. And is that the main reason why you want to work together with film? No 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 I'm just really interested in learning what everything's involved. And what I have to, what I actually would have to do myself. Okay, so you see it as an opportunity. Yeah, it's a skills. really good opportunity. Um, well, the filmmakers can make films, and we can make music. And if you want to make a music video, you need both, and neither can sort of happen without the other. Plus, it's just hands-on for both, and like, there's nothing better than being hands-on about things and trying them out. Say I'll be able to do different types of videos and stuff, and. Uh, Gives the band a good image, fighting gorillas and lads and stuff. <laughs> um, well, like, they get great experience doing music videos because, like, it's new to them. Like, they haven't done much before, and it'd be great for us as well. Like, because we've never done music videos before, and seeing seeing how it's all done would be great. Like, they get to hang out with Rockstar. They, they get to hang out with the P Dog. <laughs> Do you really think that's a benefit? Oh, it's a huge benefit. <laughs> um, I think it would give both um, good context for what they want to do in the future. It's also going to give them good experience. Just, uh, well, I think it will help the band. Uh, band's most of my life nowadays. Uh, so, yeah, we're getting the band somewhere. Do you think there could be future relationships with the filmmakers of this project as well? Hopefully, because they seem right on par with what we're thinking about, so... Good guys. Are you interested in doing uh, the possibility of getting commissioned to do music for film? If they have a film. I think it would be great. So you think this might be a process to kind of like collaborate with people? Yeah, it would be really good. Just because uh, we seem to get on really well and uh, got to bounce some ideas off each other. So good. Look, so it helps expand both like getting film and music. The two groups will learn from each other because there are disciplines that they will not be used to. And it's true. And even though some of these people think it's easy to mime, it's actually not that easy to mime. <laughs> <laughs> Just that on its own. Yeah, let's do that again. <laughs> Just even, even miming to a track can be quite tricky, and it's something you haven't had to do before. Really? Um, well, like, if the video is popular, or people like it, I'm sure it'll be great publicity for both the band and the filmmakers, and experience for both. Like, we've never made a video or anything before, so... It's a good experience. Well, just talking to the young filmmakers um, today, they were all, you know, previously just made films and um, they were looking to maybe move into making music videos. It would be a new experience for them, certainly be a new experience for us.
and I think uh, it would be mutually beneficial for the two of us. Um, what, what, what do you think the real benefits are? Uh, just like spending time with the <laughs> <laughs> with music. Yeah. Spending time with like other other bands and just like getting to shoot different things other than just regular movies and seeing how it worked differently with with a track and with a band playing. So. Um, well, they get the experience of making a music video, and we'd get the experience of working with cameras for the first time. As you can tell, we're not very good at it. Um. It'd be really fun to work together. That's all. <laughs> <laughs>